can't wait to marry you, baby. How are you feeling? I do. Man, I kept thinking of so many different things in my head. That is not what I speak, but I love it. Really? You like it? Yeah, I just, I don't know. I just had different thoughts because I had nothing to go off of, but I love it. Sick. Oh my god. Oh, I'm excited. I'm excited. You look so handsome. Thank you. Yeah. Yeah, the tie's great. Jason, uh, Eric is bringing me a tie pen. Oh, smart. Yeah. Okay, cool. And then there's no belt loops. I didn't you, realize it. You have a lavalier mic? Oh, they're going to mic they you too? They mic'd me. Okay, cool. Fun. Wow. Your little boot here is so cute. I love it. My baby. Look ahead, the sea is calm, and I know we've been through a lot, but just wait. Mm, wait for better days to come and carry us like wind in our sails. Hold on tight, I can smell the shore, it's right in front of us if we just Well, yeah, I'm just saying. Oh. <laughs> yeah. Look, I wore the socks. Yes. <laughs> months ago, I had asked you both to share things that you love and appreciate the most about one another with me. Shelby shared that you, Hunter, are laid back, optimistic, interesting, and always keep her laughing. Her favorite thing about you is your conversation. She loves that you two can talk about everything and anything and joke with each other. Hunter shared that you, Shelby, have a unique style and set of interests that really sets you apart from everyone. You are an incredible artist of many forms, including painting, drawing, design, music, knitting, and sewing, the list goes on. And that you can take, tackle any and all art projects, which is something that he always loved and admired about you. So what I found from both of you that you shared with me is that you truly appreciate what each of you brings to your relationship and you admire one another. You have grown your love and understanding for one another over the years, and I have no doubt that you will continue to grow your love and strengthen your bond in the years to come. I give you this ring in token and pledge of my constant faith and love, and as a notice to the world, that you are my wife. You can put the ring on her finger. Mm -hmm. Okay, Shelby, you can take Hunter's ring. Okay, repeat after me. I give you this ring. This one. <laughs> <laughs> Left one, yeah. I've forgotten every time. <laughs> I give you this ring in token and pledge of my constant faith and love. And as a notice to the world that you are my husband. Hunter, 
Do you take Shelby to be your wife in equal love, to honor and cherish in sorrow and joy, offering her your love and encouragement, trust and respect till death do you part? I do. And Shelby, do you take Hunter to be your husband in equal love, to honor and cherish in sorrow and joy, offering him your love and encouragement, trust and respect till death do you part? I do. I now pronounce you husband and wife. Hunter, you may kiss your bride. But I'm gonna die. a little bit more to the newly married couple, Shelby. I always think about how you used to say, that's not fair, y'all, or y'all are mean. <laughs> when surely one of us was not being very cousinly. Like when Joe wouldn't share the Nintendo game with you down the shore. I know almost all of you know the kind of person that Shelby is. She's incredibly creative, artistic, caring, supportive, fun, and loving. She has a big heart and is always ready to listen and to share with you in both your happy and tough moments. Her love is a gift and Hunter is surely lucky. Um, you know, we've been through high school, college, we went to college together as well. Um, and I, I got married and moved away probably 10 years ago. So um, I wasn't fortunate enough to be here during the time where this love uh, has flourished. Um, but uh, I got to visit uh, last year and met Shelby for the first time. You know, there's going to be many years of happiness of, for you to make for each other. Um, so we all just wanted to, you know, congratulate you. You know, so happy that you found each other. And <laughs> Welcome to the family. It only took 30-something uh, years to get a sister that I only wanted. <laughs> I couldn't ask for a better partner for my brother. Shut up, I'm making a speech. <laughs> I've watched both of you become better people because of each other, and the love and support you have for one another um, is admirable, and you both help each other grow into who you're supposed to be, and I cannot wait to watch you grow and see what this world has in store for you. Couldn't ask for a more perfect person for Hunter because I know, and you know, he's a wild card, so. Here's to a happy, healthy marriage. Congratulations, Mr. and Mrs. Jernigan. I love you both, and I am so excited for your next chapter together.
sure. Acquisition to choir. Acquisition to choir. <laughs> Okay, that's, yeah. that's just for us. That's for you too. <laughs> he'll like hold my hand in bed sometimes and he'll grab but it like I'll that like and then just start shaking it like we made a deal. <laughs> <laughs> like, and I won't stop, you know, just keep doing it. Just keep going. Yeah. Keep going. Yeah. Let go. Like, I need to go. So that was our, the wedding was our handshake deal. Completely. <laughs> Look, I'm, I'm wearing like <laughs> tube socks. <laughs> Wicked witch socks. <laughs> <laughs>